Oh yeah, because I I I have missed playing M MMOs. By the way, mm -hmm. uh, I redownloaded uh, Neverwinter. Ooh, I will do that. I forgot how much of a fucking crawl it is when you don't have anything. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, dude, like, that'd be fun for us to do. Cause uh, on the Xbox, I had a lot of stuff that was like account tied. Yeah. Well, I don't have that anymore. <laughs> Aw. Because it doesn't transfer over from Xbox to the PC. So it's one of those things where it's like, I am starting over really brand new. But I'm sticking with exactly what I tend to run, which is a fucking fighter. <laughs> I'll, I'll download it tonight. Because I, I really enjoyed playing it on the Xbox. I'll give you a heads up, though. It's not uh, controller compatible. That's fine. I play WoW well in Final Fantasy XIV without a controller. True. I, for me, it's a learning curve. Because, like, my brain is like, you should be using a controller. Uh
Hey everybody, hey, how's it going? <laughs> There we go. Move, 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 move. Okay. Remember that big tree thing I was telling you about? Yeah. There it is. <laughs> like just to the uh, north east of us. Oh, shit. Dude, that thing's like disco flashing out like it's in a rave, yeah. And then there's a watchful eye just lower too. I was trying to take out the watchful eye. <laughs> just cause like if we're gonna if we get into a fight with the tree, I don't wanna have to deal with the fucking kill you blowy up thing. Yeah. Alright. Watch while I's dead. Sweet. That tree thing, I have no idea where the fuck it went. Yeah, I'm not sure. I didn't really see. All right. Uh, you want to fight some Cyclops thingies? Um, yeah. Hey, can you uh throw a little heal my way though? Oh uh, yeah. I, before we get into anything. <laughs> no, I know. That's why I was like very carefully doing things okay yeah all good because i'm also gonna save before we fight the cyclopsy things perfect yeah there's tide hunter moon dancer bone crusher bone crusher <laughs> depending on how much experience they get give us we might be able to level up. If not, we'll be very fucking close. <laughs> Alright, saved. So. Yeah, that's fine. Damn these Cyclops things. Alright. Don't move, because they're standing near water. I'm going to try this to get their attention. Really? You move? If you hold on here, let me, uh... Yeah, there's what's the shock, not shock. Oh, where is it? Oh, is Static Cloud? Where the hell did it go, though? Give me. What are you, who are you looking at for Static Cloud? I could have sworn that the car had it. No, Static Cloud is Instead a of just arrow. Blitzbolt. You can cause a Static Cloud by hitting a uh, Steam Point. How's that? That works. So I was like, I think that's what you were intending to do. Yep. Hey, oh. Teddy. How you doing tonight, bro? One of the Bone Crushers is stunned. Uh, 
Yeah, the one all the way in the back, though. Uh, and they're all kind of grouped together, so I mean... So... Yeah. I don't want to thunder jump, because that'll fuck me up, too. Okay, work late, just chilling. Nice. Uh, summon. Oh. oh, yeah, summon will be good. Oh, Teddy, I have good news. I, uh... Had my doctor's appointment today, foot doctor again. Um, so the little infection that I was fighting last week was gone, and it, the wound managed to shrink another 67% in size in the past week. Um, given how well the appointment went today, um, there's a possibility that next week, I won't have to get the uh, debridement or the uh, skin graft. That it'll be small enough that they'll ju that they're just gonna let it, you know, that we're just gonna let it close on its own. So today was potentially the last of my procedures, dude. That is gonna be real good, because then once I get some, you know, other shit taken care of. Let's put it this way. I think I deserve a little bit of a vacation. <laughs> like a go away somewhere vacation. Right. Like. Maybe go up to Minnesota, visit you and Patricia. Or go to Michigan and. Uh. Visit Kuthar. Possibility. It's just funny because it comes up like once every like you know few months for like a a good while now. Uh, depends on when. I'm supposed to be going out of town in September. Um. A friend of mine is getting married in Southern Illinois. And we're supposed to be going down for the wedding. Uh, it's the weekend of the 17th. Oh, um, yeah, the car can't do anything. Well, I'll try to hang out. Yeah, I don't have the AP or Okay. So we'll grass turn. But yeah, Teddy, you and I gotta get into a voice chat soon because I want to find out about you know I want to be able to like actually talk to you because I got you know questions on how different things are going you know things that aren't necessarily stream chat appropriate. You know, like, I want to find out how that family's, like, how that family stuff is going. Oh, man. Bummer. It is the same weekend. All right. Oh, they hit hard. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, Teddy. Maybe a little bit closer to the holidays, then? Like, I don't know what you guys normally do for Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. Uh, fair daughter, yeah. Well, first, she has to do Ricochet. Actually, no, she doesn't. First, she has to do Farseer.
What? Still not close enough? Yeah. Well, they, I mean, they are a decent distance away, so. Now I can hit them. I'm going to do a bit of travel in the fall, maybe. Okay. Well, we'll figure something out. The holidays would be a little bit chaotic, though, too. And especially because I want to be able to hang out with everybody again when I go up there, you know? Because I enjoyed, like, you know, like, hanging out, grilling, having the, uh, the cookout with your neighbors. Oh, boy. <laughs> hmm. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, Wolgraf. No, you didn't get him. Oh, I thought he did. No, because uh, we're not standing in any water, so he's got a he has an electric weapon as well. Oh, okay, that's what that's what I saw. Then. All right, I'm gonna play a game. Talk to you later. Okay, I can definitely do that, bro. All right, thanks, Teddy. I will talk to you later. Love you. Oh, it's Bear Daughter's turn now. Yep, I. With Wolgraf, it was. I summoned Nick to add another body, and then. Uh, threw a grenade, which took out the Moon Dancer, which was the one that looked like a spellcaster, so. Okay. Aiden, what you got, buddy? <laughs> uh, sorry, I was responding to something real quick. You're good. That's... And I'm just, I don't know, I'm, I got a bunch of things I'm trying to follow up on. Fair enough.
awesome. <laughs> Bitter cold doesn't actually do damage. Shit. Well, I mean, he's petrified right now, so. I know, I just wanted to see if there was any, like, last ditch, you know, attack that I could, uh, do. Throw. But I love that I petrified him. Alright, little buddy. I'm going to put you there. Okay. There's that. Fair daughter. Basically, there's the Tide Hunter. And then the one that got stunned way at the beginning of the, of the fight. Yeah, and I do not have the ability to hit all the way up there. No, you're fine. That's what that's what the bomb guy's for. The bomb guy goes after the big crusher guy. My plan is to move the bomb guy after the big guy moves. Oh shit. Well, the, the like, one guy that was down just died, so... Just died, yep. <laughs> there you go. Cast burn my eyes on Bear Daughter. Plus two perception, which increases the range of your attacks. <laughs> nice. Alright, well, the big guy didn't fucking move, okay. Alright, little guy. We're gonna try to move you. If I do my tornado, that's not gonna blow up the summon, will it? It's not a damage, but oh god, there's a watch fly right there. All right, we'll put you right there. So I'm thinking about the tornado so we can see see through it. I kind of gave us a path. <laughs> All right, I definitely can't uh I'm just going to move up. Okay. Just... Yep, that's what I was worried about. The watch what fly. Happened? The watch fly saw you. Shit. Well, good thing Bear Daughter's next after Wolgraf, so. Invisible. Enter. Okay. Yeah, I would move Bear Daughter up and just, well, shoot at the watchful eye. <laughs> Because that uh, Cyclops still, I have a feeling, is going to go straight for that explosive, my explosive skeleton. Watch fly, buddy. 
Oh, that one. There were two. No, that was my explosive skeleton. God damn it. that hey Paul thank you for shouting out Kuthar yo oh hey buddy you just you just chose violence <laughs> mm. <laughs> totally ignored everybody and went straight for Kuthar Oh, okay, I'm okay. Hey, Claywell. How are you, bro? How's it going? All right. So we just have the one guy. <laughs> Oh, Paul, I think we meant violence, not violins. <laughs> Ooh, nice crit. All right. What, I only had the action points to do that? Well, that's messed up. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, we... like really not much to do to kill him. <laughs> I know, but I wanted to do it with a little bit of style, you know, without doing damage to us. Fair enough. <laughs> All right. Waiting for my healing to come back and then uh, saving and then we'll head to the shack, which is... Okay. <sighs> Oh, ho, ho. Yeah, so Claywell, how how are you doing, Paul? How was the rest of your day? Oh, that looks fun. That looks super fun. You should look at what's in front of the shack. Oh, the Cyclops. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's... That just made my butthole pucker. <laughs> but, with where we're at for experience, that lo looks like just enough experience. <laughs> hmm. So. 
Paul, I want you to win the lottery so I don't have to work either. I mean, wait, that didn't come out right. Yeah, it did. All right, if you want to move up to where I'm at. <laughs> Gonna slowly encroach our way up there. All right. Well, I know what I'm doing first. Examine the big dude. He is mostly resistant to water. Okay. How what's um, the percentage? Ninety. Okay, so he's not he's not gonna get healed by water. Yeah. Um fire is ten, air thirty, earth ten, poison ten, piercing minus twenty five. Okay, so piercing is his weakness. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. That I can't hit him. I don't think that worked. No, it didn't. Yep. Oh, you mother fucker. Well, Kuthar's out for a, for a bit. But, you know what's funny? They're what, too? Works the same fucking way. Yeah, I would just not move and just attack from where you can. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, hold on. Uh, Farseer. Ricochet. Fortunately for Bear Daughter, everything she does is piercing damage. Okay, apparently the Reapers have an ability to, to cause somebody to become invulnerable. They made the Spirit Caller invulnerable. Oh, damn it. So, target the Reapers. Damn it, the stun failed. That's okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Why didn't I remove your debuffs? I should have removed your debuffs. That's alright, they're gone now, so... 
when it gets to my turn, I'll be fine. All right, let's see. You're invulnerable right now, so... Let's go with the frozen one. And don't shoot my explodey skeleton. <laughs> okay. He's got a mission. <laughs> How do we clear invulnerability? Uh, it's just gotta wait the turns. So. Yeah, but that's three turns. <laughs> no, he's at one now. Or, he's probably at one now, but we'll see. He's invulnerable, which means he can't take damage, but he can still stay. Uh, he should still be able to take status effects. Hmm. Nope, still gotta target the other guys. Oh, does it say you can't target him? No, no, I'm just. Gonna target the other guys. <laughs> yeah. Not status. <clears throat> okay, then I'm going to do one. I'm just going to do sh regular shoe. And I am going to save bank those three. So that my next turn, I should have enough to do Rain of Arrows. I was just one shy right there. Let's go right there, buddy. Don't fuck a trip, please. And right there. It's one of those things where it's like, I put up an ice wall in front of the guy who's invulnerable, so he has to actually work his time off. That nice. Ooh, nice. I, I put fear on him. Good. Ha! Huh. And me and Bear Daughter are far back enough he can't target us. Nice. Like, because of obstructions. Alright, Nick, time to go be an annoying thing. <laughs> and yeah, that's it for World Rep. Alright, buddy. I wonder if I can... Yeah, I, sh I think I can hit them both. Ricochet? Nope. Oh! R Rain of Arrows. Oh, wait, who is. The oh, that's Nick. It's okay if you hit him. He just spreads poison when he gets hit, so. Just makes the battlefield harder for that guy.
Ta-da! All right. <clears throat> He's invulnerable. I don't care. Yeah, so status effects don't... <laughs> are, can't go through either, so... Invulnerable is quite literally invulnerable. <laughs> so I would just bank your points at this point. The fuck did he do? Whoa. Oh, he did destroy summon. Okay. It's like, what the fuck? He did like 4,000 damage. I'd say if you want to... I'd have to move her. Yeah, I was going to say, if you want to move her and then... Yeah, there I would actually be able to hit... Okay. I was just checking the range. Okay. <laughs> I'm invulnerable. I I know that. It's called field effects. You're no longer invulnerable, you son of a bitch. Haha. <laughs> All right, buddy, there's a pool of oil there. <laughs> All right, then I'm moving right here. And shit. My fireball is still on cooldown. Uh... Fire elemental? Ah. <laughs> oh, no, hold on. What scrolls do I have? Scrolls are good. <laughs> I might have a fireball scroll. No. Blessed Earth, bless all. Oh no, the Blessed Earth one just blesses us. Flare just casts Magical Heat that does... Oh, 102 to 125 fire. You think that'll ignite the oil? Yep. And it would cause him to have to move because he can't see us. Granted, we can't see him at the moment, but... Uh, he had enough AP to do... Never mind. Oh, he shielded himself. And he's running like a little bitch. 
Wow. Okay. Let's see what we got. Anything I didn't put in the hot bar? Hey, Hawkeye. Welcome home. Okay, these guys are being assholes. <laughs> well, this guy in particular is being the it's asshole. Like a banking a shit ton of points, cause. And he's shielded, so I can't. Oh, and I can't. Yeah, no, we. No, I mean, I think I can hit him because. Oh no, I don't. But there's a, there's a cloud of smoke in front of yeah. you. So if you want to bank until he can be targeted. <laughs> ah, finishing podcast back up? Okay. Oh, that reminds me. I haven't checked um, Brain Pong. Uh, did uh, Rummy or Skippy get back to us about the topic? I mean, I could just move up a little, which I will. And call that. Ah, uh, no worries. I mean, we're pretty much going to end up bringing it up anyway. And then I'll be announcing something on the podcast. Target's too far, of course, for Vicar. I mean, at this point, I think he's pretty much dead with having to deal with Nick and the wolf. I still want to move up. Uh, well, you feared him, so... And petrified. Wow, he is... <laughs> He's fucked. I, I'm shielded. Okay, you're bleeding to death, you're petrified, and you're afraid, so... Good luck. <laughs> yeah, I'm just... At this point, I'm... Ending my Actually, turn. Actually, Hawkeye, I'm gonna DM it to you. <laughs> I'm just ending my turns at this point, because... Once it gets to Nick and the wolf... <laughs> He's definitely done. <laughs> So, not to mention there there is fire right there that I'm actually surprised that the car didn't catch on fire walking through. <laughs> yep, Hawkeye just DM'd it to you. No, I'm hitting the.
pocket just because I I have the bow sparrow. Oh, I should have just done that. All right, there is some un there's some Love stuff for you. To and unidentified. Oh wait, Kutha. That was a charm. Well, first of all, for Bear Daughter, let's send that love grenade to Woolgrass. The first one, 63 to 105 player. Here's a chance to set not down. Plus one leadership. No, I don't wanna. I don't wanna mess with the wands right now. Um, next item. Resolute. Move my fucking mouth. Resolute, excellent jack of plates of air resistance. 84 armor rating, 20% fire resistance, 24% air resistance, plus one initiative, plus uh, 1.05 movement, and immunity to muted. Hmm. What did you say the armor was? 84. Ah. It requires a dexterity at 9. Uh, wool graph's good. Okay. Actually, let me send it to Bear Daughter and check her room. She's got the high enough dexterity. Yeah, I'm just walking around the shack and. I'd lose. I'd lose a dexterity actually if I did. But that. Uh... It'd be a little bit more movement and immunity to muted, but she doesn't need it. Okay. Unidentified superior male armor spikes. 102 armor rating. 20% water resistance plus 0.7 movement. Inflict throws on contact. Reflect 20% of melee damage as piercing damage. Uh, level 16 requires strength 9. Send it to Kuzar. I'll compare it. And then there's boots. Fitting veteran metal boots for sneaking. Uh, 42 armor rating, 24% like resistance, plus 1 sneaking, 79 HP, requires strength 9. Uh, send it to Kuthar. <laughs> okay. And then just regular roll leather bracers, 37 armor rating. Okay. Self fodder, I'm sure. Alright, buddy. If you want to come in here, and I'm going to save before we head down this fucking hatch. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's where the fucking demon is. We're definitely leveling up after this fight. <laughs> yep. All right. Haw Hawkeye, did you see the the message? Oh, he's got a menagerie of stuff. Oh God, do you see what's in there? Oh yeah, he's got. Like I said, he's got a menagerie of stuff. Cyclops floaters. He's got like a whole fucking cage full. Well, what happened? All right. You don't look like one of the women in red little henchmen, now do you? Mm, no. He's a far more noble, 
Okay, so what do we call your I'm gonna change where I'm at. And now. Okay. Ready? Uh, um, no, I gotta get out of this dialogue thing. Hold on. Okay. Um, yeah, I would position yourself somewhere that you think will be good. Just as a heads up, from what I read, there's gonna be. Roughly eight things popping up once we fight, start the fight with them. So if you want to position yourself somewhere where... God damn it. Uh, I'm not really sure where I should position myself. Like, maybe like right here. Okay. Ready? Yep. Okay, if you s the slaves of torment, take them out. <laughs> they are what give him his major resistances. Okay. Wait, what are their resistances? Let me. S oh shit! A hundred percent to everything, but they are a hundred percent weak to air. Uh, it might be different for each one, because each one represents an element. Oh. Just as a heads up. Well, then... Oh, buddy. Huh. They're level 19. We're level 17. And that one is water. Okay. There. I stunned one, froze another. Okay. Here goes this. Damn. I was hoping for that. Okay, it's Bear Daughter's turn. There's no resistance to piercing, so I'm just gonna regular. I'm just gonna sh uh, ricochet. Okay.
damn it. Okay. That one's almost dead. Try to add that to slow down the enemies on that side. Counteract that thing's fucking haste. Bring it the fuck on! <laughs> Alright, he scared Wolgraf. Oh god! <laughs> Really unfortunate the fucking fire ones all the way up there. Um Why did that not... Okay, Does... apparently that doesn't do fear. Okay. And that one's... <laughs> Oh, yeah, it was one. I have water arrows. Yay. Ow. Fuck. Hmm. Where the shot? Okay. Uh, the demon should now be weak against uh, lightning attacks, just as a heads up. Is Barbarus? Yeah. Because we took out the lightning one. Actually, it just shows all of the resistances at 80%. Hmm. Oh, except for Tenebrium, which is 50%. Okay. Which I'm just going to hit him with my wands because the one does Tenebrium damage. Yep. Uh, okay, that was not... That was not what I thought it would Oh, wait, that one was, yeah, water. Oh, I don't have any water. 
Oh, uh, wait. Crap. Yeah. You get a damage boost. <laughs> Well, they just killed me. Damn it! That motherfucker's in the way of... Yep. Alright! That worked. <clears throat> Which was what I wanted the spell to do. God. Ow. We are not ready for this fight. Okay, Hawkeye. So I'm reloading. <laughs> That went from, I think we can handle it to, oh. So we'll have to come back here and after we explore for a bit. Actually, you know what? How are you huh. doing on items that you need to sell? I've got some shit I can sell. All right, we're going back to Silver Glen. We're going to do some selling and try and buy some shit. <laughs> And then I'm going to start looking up the random quests that we still have. I'm literally just heading straight to where I normally head for this. <laughs> Which is yep. the opposite side of town from where you, the goblin is. Because I know you tend to go with the goblin first. Yeah. I'm going to try to sell a bunch of my old wands. Wand first. Okay. 
What is my five and two? And I have five and two. What? Why is he telling me to the offer insults him? I. Is your money balanced? Yeah. I threw in my items. I hit add gold to match balance offers. Oh, wait a minute. I see why. What's up? I don't think he had enough. Oh. God damn it. No. I don't know why this is being so fucking stupid now all of a sudden. Okay. Oh, hey, welcome back, Hawkeye. Fuck it, he's not letting me sell anything. He doesn't like any of the items that you're trying to pick off. Hmm. Yeah, fuck this goblin. Are you like try selling li a little bit, not a lot? See I did. I tried selling one single item. And he just was like, no. And he's like, your offer insults me. So he must want to buy like, or he want, must want us to like give it to him for cheap. Well, he can fucking eat me, so. Great, where do I go to sell all this shit now? Uh, the tavern that I'm at. There's quite a few different people that you can talk to. Oh god, that guy only has three gold? Fuck. Uh, find people with names, not miners. <laughs> I 
and then see if they have stuff that you want to buy as well. I just fucking... Most of the money I spent was not even on myself. It was on Wolgraf. Wolgraf has a shit ton of grenades now. Well, these guys over here just don't have any gold. Is that a problem? Ah. Oh, wait. This guy does have some. Your offer insults me. What the hell? Uh, why all of a sudden can't I fucking sell any? Trying to figure that out. I mean. Uh, if you wanna, if you're frustrated, I'm, I'm gonna try something here. Um, oh, that's a die. Well, you know, what? wait, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna try it. I just tried to even purchase something. A fabric die and they're like your offer insults me all right well if you want to send me all your stuff to kuthar i'll sell it because apparently nobody has an issue with me selling shit to them yeah just i know it, it like i have no idea why they're doing that but it's because the game's just discriminating against it. it's just because it's me Oh, wait a minute. Why can't I? No, not that one. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Okay. There, I sent you everything from Vicar. Let me see what Bear Daughter's got. Oh, yeah, Bear Daughter's got some shit, too. Okay.
<laughs> Welcome to the selling up or, or the shopping episode. <laughs> well, it had been said and done if everything was going to work right. Right, yeah, if the whole game wasn't being a bitch or like like it won't even let Ooh, I wonder. Oh, yeah. And then there was that. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Trade done. All right. Although now I'm wondering something. Send that to Wolgraf. Send that to Bear Daughter. Send that scroll to Vicar because I figured you'd find that really cool. Sent you a lightning storm scroll. Oh, nice. I was trying to buy that, and it wouldn't let me. All right. I also bought an amulet that I, I get a plus... It's plus two strength, plus two intelligence, 20% water resistance, and reflect 15% of any damage is fire damage. Nice. And by increasing my intelligence, I have reduced the cooldown for a lot of my spells. All right. Time to look up some stuff. Yeah, I even tried adding gold. Oh, you literally tried to purchase. I'm trying to buy this guy's all the arrows this guy has. Oh, dude, I was able to just pay the guy a little bit of gold to, ident to identify a level 5 lore master. Hmm. Hey, I want to try something. Okay. I'm going to need you to reinvite me. Okay. I'm going to relaunch my game. And, of course, there's a Steam update. Hmm. I wonder if that had something to do with it. That is highly possible.
Team. Divinity play. All right. Could you go ahead and send me another invite? Yeah. Invite. Let's try this. Buy this guy's hair. Yep. I was able to buy the arrows. All right. And... Now, for the car. And I was able to do that. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I don't know what that glitch was. All right. But now let me send all these zeros to Bear Daughter. Yep. Summon Fire Elemental, Summon Spider, and Lightning Storm. Nice! Yep. I got a few things that I think will help us, but we'll figure that out as we go. <laughs> yeah. So. I just need you to. I pop back up on me, just because I. I well, I was just move, moving these scrolls real quick. Oh, we're okay. trying to get everything organized. A little bit. All right. Hey, Marie, how are you doing tonight, love? Welcome in. It's always good. It's always good to see you. Like, every time I see you pop in chat, I keep just, like, picturing just this, like, big, bright smile. Yeah. 
Uh-oh. Oh. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm gonna save real quick. And we're going down there? Uh, I don't know what's down there. Well, let's find out. Let's see. Oh, yep, we've been through this area. So, top. All right. Grave dig. Oh, no. Numerous. Yes, give me a second. To pull up. So correct. Correct, you must. Let us <laughs> not entirely know. No. Uh, concur. Yeah, I know I sorry. Um I think so. Last query. Your salvation. Indeed. <laughs> Indeed. Ooh. <laughs> Go ahead, oh. buddy. It's probably full of very low level gear. <laughs> no, no. There's a dog here I want to talk to. So we gotta find this dude's, uh, we gotta find his friend Jake. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We've dealt with Jake already. Wait, you said something about finding out who killed him. Y yes. So. All right, let's see what's in this grave. Helen. Hi, Helen. <laughs> I believe you've okay. got, I, I'm pretty sure you've got this with just your wands. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Fire and crushing. Okay, the resistance to poison. Okay. Also, I sent you some things to identify that required level four uh, to identify it. So, okay.
Barbaric, excellent robe of fire resistance, 78 armor rating, plus 2 strength, plus 24% fire resistance. Okay. Um, requires intelligence 9. And my, my stuff is better, though. And the maiming Bardish of Storms. Uh, Two-handed weapon, 117 to 206 slashing, 30 to 52 air, plus one leadership. 25% uh, chance to set stunned, 30% chance to set bleeding. Requires strength at 12. Hmm. Let's just sell Potter, so... Okay. Yep, I'm just literally. It's one of those things where it's like you come back and you're way more powerful, and you're like, okay, let's see what we can. Okay, so we already entered that building, so. Really, in here. Specifically came here to buy a book. <laughs> Okay. Thank you for teleporting on me. Yep. All right. Ooh, this is first thing I have to find. Let's see, summon Earth Elemental. Yep. Cleansing Water. Here's blind meat, disease, infected, bleeding, crippled, and decaying. That does stuff the other scroll that I have doesn't. Okay. Oh, and that's a blank water scroll, so I don't need that. Cool. He accepts my offer. Yay. Okay. Do you have what I want? You are certainly becoming my favorite customer. One more to do. Then it's done delivery time. Okay. All right. Just what I fucking needed for Wolgraph. By the way, Hawkeye, did we have any ideas for a video?
Good. All right. Uh... He who smelt it <laughs> buys one. No, no, Grove. Grove. I want to go with Grove. Oh, she was downstairs. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, buddy. I'm just I, just working on. Okay. All right. Okay, that sounds good. All right, going to his brother because he's got that. He's in a unique, like, closed off area. Chest behind the door. Go, Lady, go, 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 go. Okay. So does that I wonder if that just unlocked the door. No, but the door is still locked. Shit. Yeah. All right. So. Okay. Welcome back. Try something at this point. Okay, so that didn't do what I wanted it to. Hey, hey Shim, thanks so much for the raid. How you doing tonight? Welcome in. Just as a heads up, that is instant death that you're right next to. How was your stream? Hey, Static, what's going on? Hey, Hawkeye. Oh, thank you. There you go. How was uh, Mass Effect? Oh, and thank you, thank you so much for the follow there, Static. Now, uh, uh, Shim, are you playing through the first one? Or are you doing like the second or the third? Ah, oh, hold on, I have an idea. I got the chest. Oh, you did? Yep. What was in it? Uh, it was a, it's a special amulet. Uh, the Royal Guard Talisman. Okay. Uh, it is needed for the Winter King's Palace. Ah, uh, okay. Now, Shim, is this your first time playing Mass Effect? So, can I go? Because I just played, I just played the first one for the uh, first time this past year myself. Uh, this is the Enhanced Edition. Unfortunately, there wasn't a category for it uh, when I was setting uh, when I was setting the category static. Cat, what? 
Huh? Uh, I'm not familiar with what the fuck you just said. Category static? Static is the person I'm talking to. Oh. Okay. Fair enough. Hmm. Alright, we'll grab Yeah. That. It's just like I'm uh, playing through Kingdom Hearts 2 right now, but... Well, you know, when I stream, I got it listed as the um, the 1.5 and 2.5 HD remix, just because that's the actual disc that it's off of. Even though I'm playing specifically Kingdom Hearts 2. All right, uh, if you want to teleport on me. Yep. Sometimes we have to just get the category as close as we can. Save. All right. Like when I play Cards Against Humanity, I have it under Tabletop Simulator. Because that's the game that we're playing it through. Yep, I'm just trying to sneak through as we'll grab at this point. Oh, okay. Shim, I am really enjoying it. Um, this is my first time playing through it. And I had I had wanted to play this game for years. Um, to the point that I actually bought it for like two or three other people and like gifted it to them. Hoping to have somebody to freaking play it with over the years. And uh, turns out Kuthar here. I'm going to give him a shout out. Hmm. Okay. Um, static, it's actually hard for me to answer that because I haven't played through it solo. I have own like this is my first time playing it and I'm doing it co-op. Um but it is fucking fun with friends though. I will say that. Now it's only it's only two people for the first one. Um Divinity Original Sin 2 though, uh which I did play through the beginning of that solo, allows for four player co-op. So if you can get an actual group of people to play through too. Oh, nice. Okay, so you already know all about it. So you'll have to excuse me for just randomly telling you shit you already know. So like in this first game, God does agree on something you can actually have. Oh yeah, yeah we've had we've had a couple of those. Hey, they took that away in the sec. Oh man, oh that sucks. Okay, so like, where exactly is? Oh, he's got these more up here. No. Uh, where did Wolgraf go? I snuck through a bunch of shit, and I'm getting a bunch of shit at the moment. Oh, okay. So, you'll have to bear with me, because I can't... Well, it's all good. But yeah, no, I'm... I'm enjoying this game. I, uh... I love, like, RPGs. I've uh, been getting into more MMO. Definitely a lot of fun. Yeah. Tell me anything you think anyone... <laughs> That's a good way to look at it, but the way I look at it, I don't 
really look at things as the whole like viewer streamer dynamic. Mm-hmm. It's like you can ask Kuthar here, you can ask anybody. Like for me, the dynamic is you come in here, we're friends. <laughs> you know. And the point is that, you know, we're just enjoying it together. Alright, buddy. Use the teleporting stone. Okay, hold on, because I was actually taking it I'm taking a second to refill. Okay. There. All right. Fear stream dynamics good when fuckers come in and backseat. See, I haven't had problems with necessarily anybody backseating stuff. I've been very fortunate in that respect. Had a hate rate or two, though. People coming in with, like, names trying to, you know, spoil shit. Like, uh, I was streaming Spider-Man on the PS4. Oh. And uh, it was the weekend the last movie came out, and people were using usernames that spoiled parts of the movie just in their names alone. All right, buddy, if you want to use the pyramid again. <laughs> I deal with more of that shit. <laughs> All right. I sent you a whole bunch of shit to get identified, by the way. Oh, boy. When I was exploring his wool graph. Well, that we're not going to need. The shield, fuck it, we don't use shields. Fireman solid, leather boots and mobility, 29 armor rating. Uh, oh, yeah. No, those are fucking not. They don't. Most of that stuff was like lower level stuff, so I'm not going to even uh, worry about it. Yeah, but some of the stats are better than the boots that I got. Well, yeah, because you, you've been holding on to I don't want to slip. <laughs> and it has served me well so yes, far. Yes, it has. Yeah, I'm not, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not bashing you. I'm literally stating it's like... That's why you haven't gotten that, so. Alright, um. On this one, I am just sending the bear daughter, and I'll take a look at that in a minute. Where's the little brother again? Metal bracers, the 32 armor rating, one pickpocketing, 64 HP, 8. Self-otter. Ah. Oh, player resistance and initiative and <laughs> immunity to hated. No, my current robe does immunity to knockdown and I have other shit that gives me immunity to muted, so. Right. And this amulet does 21% water resistance, reflects 10% of melee damage as fire damage. And nope. Because my amulet is what gives me the immunity to muted. <laughs> plus one intelligence. <laughs> so, I don't think so. And then I have my scrolls. So, okay. We ID'd everything. Oh. Oh, that when we were playing Terraria on stream. Well, Shim, what happened when you were playing Terraria? 
you've you've intrigued me. All right, we're gonna go here. Well, Bear Daughter leveled up. <laughs> nice. So now I just got to figure out one of these fucking quests to build a house and the viewer and see something like, oh, no, build it like that or up. Oh. oh, God. I, I can't stand when people do shit like that. I saw a lot of that when uh, Ginger was playing Terraria too. Just well, I can just add that to the list of reasons why I haven't streamed Terraria. <laughs> well, or any time I had a tool or weapon they thought wasn't good, and they immediately oh, did you need to go to the A family? Yeah, people need to just. Have some chill and just let you play how you want to play. All right. Since we unlocked a star stone, are you are you uh, in the middle of leveling up Bear Daughter? Uh, I was gonna, yeah. Okay. But I ended up um, pausing for a second to look at the um, bow I identified. Okay. Tell me when you're ready, because we're going to teleport to the end of time. We, which... um... Okay, so I have a attribute uh, thing. Do I... Should I up my perception? Yeah. Uh... Or no, or was it speed? Initiative and how many action points you gain per... Yeah, speed. Because that way you can get more action points. Yep. And I have five points available for skills. Okay. Uh, her expert marksman is at five, right? Yes. Uh, go de defense. Okay. What is bodybuilding and willpower at? Uh, bodybuilding three, willpower four. Uh, yeah. Uh, I would say willpower. Because <laughs> that would give you a high, a really high uh, improve against saves that are against Done. feared, mute, charmed, stunned, cursed, slowed, petrified, decaying, touch, mark of death, remorse, and shackles of pain. Eh. All right. Done. Okay. Okay, she's leveled. What are we doing? All right, we're going to the end of time. Alright. Uh, yeah, Trey is not a game to be streaming again for, for just for that reason. See, I've played a little bit of that game on my own. I would love to try it co op, actually, with somebody. Go talk to fucking. But there's one reason we'll never stream a D&D game, but I'm enjoying the hell out of Guild Wars 2. I played like the very beginning of Guild Wars 2. Just to try it. I don't know. I mean, I've been in I've been in D&D campaigns that have been streamed. And we Fortunately, with that, we never had any trouble. Okay, well, that's not... Alright, uh... Alright, we're gonna go here first. Just because we also... We picked up more self-otter. 
Although I will say this, though, sometimes it is just nice to play D and D and not have to, or to be able to like play a game like that and not have to worry about streaming it. Mm-hmm. Me, me, and Kuthar play of uh, uh, D and D every other Saturday. All right, goblins out of money. <laughs> Aw. I was going to make him. Hold on. I have to do something just. Oh, no, he's literally out. Okay. Yeah. I was going to try to sell one thing just so he would actually approve it. And I'd be like, ha. Fuck I mean, if you, you got, See, if you got something super cheap. Uh... Let me see. I don't. So, screw it. Yeah, we were having a really weird glitch earlier, guys, where I couldn't sell or purchase from a merchant. I had to, like, close out of the game and reload in. Well, when I closed out of the game, Steam had an update. Okay. Okay. To the mines. Because we gotta. Great. I can't teleport. Fuck. Nope, you're fine. I literally was just popping in to do a thing. Now we all level. Now we the rest of us leveled up. Okay. So, speed for Kuthar. I think I'm going to up the car's perception. For range? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Okay, now he has six points. Ooh, adds over? Good. Hmm. No, so I was starting to say that we were having a really weird glitch earlier tonight that it wasn't letting me sell or buy from a merchant. So I ended up having to close out of the game, but it was weird. When I closed out, I had a Steam update. I don't know that that actually... I don't know how that could have, you know, contributed, but... It was weird. I reloaded in, and then everything worked. All right. For Kuthar, I brought up his Hydrofist. Graph's perception. Try leveling up his sneaking. Oh, I... All right. Now I'm just trying to figure out what's skilled up for our. Yep, you're. Do I max out my pyro, or do uh, I feel like I should throw in? No, I'm gonna throw an extra point in Aerothurge, because 
Aerothurge is what a lot of my spells have ended up being. Um, you think? I haven't committed it yet. So, how many points do you have to spend? Six. And your, what's your pyrokinetic at? Four. Okay. So I can actually I can actually level that up, but my arrow thurge is only at two. What's your witchcraft at? Three. Okay. Um, what are your defenses at? Three and three. Okay. Uh, weapons. Uh, five dual wielding, one tenebrium, one wand. Okay. What is? Uh, check to see if you have any skill books they haven't read yet. Explode. That's an adept skip. Spell for fire. Yeah, I, I can't learn that one. I've got Death Punch, Rhythmic Scream, Soul Sap, and Mute for um, what is that? Ooh, and then I have Make Invisible. For a narrow third. I don't think I can read one of these yet. Soul Sap does what different one though. Uh that is Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, but I'm already gonna leave him learn if you end up and it's a bit earlier than one. Oh, dude, go, go take care of that, dude. Self care, get some rest, dude. Again, thank you so much, Shim, for the raid. I appreciate you. You thank you so much for being here, hanging out. Hope you have. Hope you have an easier night. Hey, Lids. Thanks so much. Thanks so much for the lurk. Hope you have a wonderful evening. All right. So I think I'm going to... I'm going to try to raise my witchcraft. Okay. Okay, there. And I have two points left there. Because I'm going to try to read one of the... Should I do Mute, Death Punch, or Horrific Scream? The Horrific Scream sets feared. Um, death Punch, 632 to 773, crushing damage to a target near you. And... Mute, obviously Mute. Um, there's a soul sap that um, lowers all of the powers and resistances. Ooh. Oh, so it does more than just the resistances. Okay. Primary attributes are decreased by two. Their body building and willpower abilities are decreased by five. And all of their elemental and physical right. resistances are decreased by 50. Give me Ooh, one second. Yes. Guys. I got to reload. Okay. I'm trying to do the sneaking past the uh, the death knights. So. I think I'm going to do the soul sap. Okay. Just because of how much more that it actually lowers. Okay. Ooh, 
Ooh, and I was able to learn music. Cool. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> I know Olgraf is the sneaky beaky boy, but man, this fucking sucks. <laughs> I see one. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> oh, God. Oh yeah, no, I am fucking terrified doing this, like. Wow. <laughs> it's like, uh. Here you go, baby daughter. Take that for now. Gold. Okay. Um. Ooh, nice. Oh, okay. Going to save and continue my daring journey with Wolgraf. Okay. Go, go, love you, son of a bitch. Hey, Arch, how you doing tonight? Welcome in. How is your Wednesday going, my friend? Go, 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 I believe in you. You sneaky son of a bitch. I don't care. <laughs> Woolgraf spotted a trap. Don't care. It's like, fuck that. I'm out anyway. <laughs> Just another night. How am I doing? Dude. I had a really encouraging day. Some uh, ha had an appointment today that I got some good news. I'm gonna try. So uh, okay. Yeah. Well, without without going into too much detail, um, I injured my right foot. Um. 
have a bit of a wound on it, but it hasn't wanted to close. So I've been having to go through and get skin grafts and things like that. Okay, we're going to try this. And um, today uh, we determined that it, we don't think I'm going to need any more uh, of the procedures just because of like how good it finally started healing. All right. Use the the portal. You want Lucilia Chasm. I only have forest for Lucilia. Really? It doesn't seem to work here. Hold on. I know what I'm going to do. Gonna try this. All right, now use the the waypoint shrine. You must now wait. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Now, now try and use the waypoint shrine and see if you can see the chasm portal. Yes. Okay, I figured out why I had it. Because I had Wolgraf who discovered it. All right, saving. Hmm. And this is where I'll... Oh, and thanks, Arch. What's up, Uh, This is where I'm going to call it. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Because... Well, not sure exactly what... Where else to go with this, but... <laughs> Just... Okay, well, let me go ahead and back out then. All right. All right, but yeah, Arch, it's, uh, dude, you don't want to know how long I've been dealing with that shit either. <laughs> so yeah, it is fucking amazing news. But, uh, you're doing good, though? Alright, who who you got, buddy? Uh, I see Zero is playing PUBG. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, let's do zero. Even 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 though here it takes Ooh sub anniversary, that's gonna drive me nuts. Who? Zero? Okay. Well look, I mean zero will love it, but anyway. Wait, who are who are you thinking, Hawkeye? Hawkeye have a we target? We obviously have... Hawkeye said he might have a target. Okay. I'm on the edge of my seat. Ooh, 
tiny Dead by Daylight? Mm. Oh, I didn't even see her on. Wow. Cool. Uh, um, her, uh, her name is Tiny Monsters Gaming. She's a, she's a sweetheart. Okay. Actually, yeah, let's... Would you be cool we raided her? Yep. All right. No, no. No, because um, one of the last times that we raided, we raided zero. Yeah. So. So, we we like we actually like to mix it up. So I'm actually really glad that you came up with that suggestion, Hawkeye. Thank you. So. So yeah. Uh fuck next time i will be on will be tuesday next week <laughs> hmm. with, with more stardew valley <laughs> yep and tomorrow's thursday so i will be back tomorrow with more kingdom hearts nice well kingdom hearts 2 so i will see you guys tomorrow love you guys have a wonderful night right, have a good night guys ready now yep